Hello everyone, welcome back to Chucky Days. Today I am going to be mispronouncing all of the Fellowship characters' names. So that's nine characters coming at you completely wrong. At number one we have the infamous Freddo Boggins. He's the bearer of the One Ring, chicken dancer and love maker. It's Freddo Boggins. Freddo Boggins would not have got anywhere without old Gaffer Jr. He may heave, he may grieve, but most importantly, he dropped no Eve. Next up we have Mithrandir. He's one of the five wizards of Middle-earth. He's a lover of Shire folk and oh, that's just one of his other names. Oh, so many. Next up, possibly the most important member of the Fellowship, a Rogan, an arrogant man who walks around going, mm-hmm, I'm a sealed door's heir, step aside peasants, watch me be king, this guy. Next up we have Legless, a pretty boy elf who tries to be profound and deep. A red sun rises, blood has been spilled this night. This forest is old, very old. And he often finds it hard to walk. It's legless. Next up we have Grime. Now, thing you need to understand here. It's hard being a dwarf, okay? You, you have pointy-eared elvish princelings just looking down on you and you have to comb and plait your beard. Every day. I'm sorry. Next up we have Mercy. He's a proud six foot three with toes hairier than your weave. It's everyone's favourite hobbit, Mercy. Next up we have Pipley. <sighs> Who let a tween be a part of the fellowship? I mean, he's only 28. <sighs> Such child endangerment. And lastly, but certainly not least, we have number one best son. He's the firstborn, the prodigy. I mean, the man can do no wrong. Except, you know, <coughs> try and take the ring and pretty much break up the entire fellowship. <coughs> it's Denethor's number one son. The best son. The only son. Fuck Faramir. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give it a like and subscribe and to hit the bell icon. All of that, you know, you know. Until then, I will see you in my next video. Bye.